Hello, you're welcome to Hashtags on Business Day TV. Today, I'll be taking you through some of the trending topics that made their way on social media platform Twitter. Um, it's been a um, activity field week on Twitter. Many people commenting on things that um, concerns them. For us here on Business Day, we um, we follow particularly the announcement by the president, um, which says I'll be traveling to the uni United Kingdom tomorrow to see my doctor at his request. We'll be away for four days back in Abuja on Saturday, May 12th. That post received a lot of retweets and 4,300 likes. But what's particularly interesting about a post isn't the announcement. It's uh, a statement that followed after that announcement that actually got a lot of people um, tweeting where it appears that the president made a mistake or the president's handlers didn't quite go through the um, the topic uh, the, or their posts. It reads, um, President Buhari will tomorrow, Tuesday, undertake a four-day trip to the United Kingdom to see how doctor. Uh, he will return Saturday, May 12th. On his return, the president two day stayed visit to Jigawa postponed because of the APC World Congresses will now take place 14th and 15th May. Um, that particular era there of how Dr. Way was supposed to write uh, his doctor got a lot of people um, very angry, not so very happy. So um, we have people saying that the president's handlers should be sacked. Our next uh, trending topic was from Fatima Abba Wakube, um, who was concerned about how people were commenting ab um, about the president going to London for his medical um, checkup. And she she tweeted and said, um, um, the comments following M. Buhari tweets regarding his short medical leave is, is quite distressing. I really don't know what Nigerians want at this point. And, um, that tweet got a lot of Nigerians angry and some people um, got her, uh, started trolling her. So we have uh, a top tweet here that says, this isn't about being transparent, this is about Buhari who is a scam. He scammed millions of Nigerians to vote for him. Moving on up to another um, trending topic, we have Yobe. Now this one is very positive. We have, um, with all that has been happening in, in, in Northeast Nigeria, so we have uh, people trying to look at uh, areas that people can actually say this is um, um, what is good about the northeast. So um, somebody actually took a picture, a very beautiful picture of Yobe and posted it online and it got a lot of people um, talking about Yobe. And you need to see the pictures, they're very, very um, beautiful. That tweet says, this is not Dubai, Yobe you've never seen. Uh, pictures, uh, pictures of Yobe State Desert, um, camels, um, very beautiful um, pictures about Yobe. It's really, really beautiful. It's nothing compared to um, the crisis happening there up, up in the northeast. And um, we have a lot of people here retweeting and commenting, and they're saying that's not weird at all. Sometimes I find myself liking some kinds of names, and I'm making fun of it. And uh, somebody says. Um, uh, not really. Uh, not really. I, I I once heard about the place. Um, it basically just opened up your base state for a lot of people um, this week. I um, will encourage you to keep tweeting and keep uh, sending those topics away. We'll read them. You never know when your own tweet will pop up on our screen. Until we see you next week. My name is Frank Elias.